that would be a nice little I'm saying this I've got two outfits there and then I've actually got another outfit in here kind of half of an outfit there's one more shirt who wants to say I'm obsessed with shirts because I am if you've seen my vlog you will have seen my little knicker haul Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to another video. Tonight's video is going to be a huge holiday clothes haul. So I'm going to show you everything I've been buying over the last few months ready for my holiday and I'm so excited. Not going to lie, I didn't really think I had that much until I've got everything out for this video and actually I have got quite a few new bits. So if you're interested in this video, then let's get on with it. So I was literally going to go back to the shops today because I was going to go and panic buy. But then when I've got everything out for film in this video, I've actually got a lot more than I even thought. So I have just had another bikini order delivered. So I've got quite a few bits to show you. So what I'll do is I'll just show you everything and I'll insert some clips. I'm not gonna try the bikinis on or I might just put the top in, I don't know. Um, so whatever you see is what I've done. But I'm gonna show you everything I've been buying over the last few sort of weeks, months. Um, so yeah, let's get on with it. Basically, I feel like I don't even know where to start. Let's start with, let's start with, okay. So I'm going to a wedding in Cyprus. That's where we're going. We're going away to Cyprus and it is for a wedding. So I think the first thing I'll show you actually is the wedding outfit. Um, basically I looked high and low for an outfit and I couldn't find anything. I did order a few bits from Karen Millen but they were, they were really tight dresses which I just kind of felt like wouldn't really look, you know, the whole, we're going on an all inclusive for a week and I was just thinking it's probably not the best idea to wear something tight. In a broad wedding it's going to be hot so I got something more floaty so I ordered this dress off ASOS and it's actually from Topshop. I'm not gonna try this on only because it's obviously for an occasion and I wanna keep it for that. So it's a halter neck, pink Topshop dress, literally halter neck, you tie it at the back and then it's got a really low back and then it's super floaty and frilly. I feel like that is not doing it justice, but that is my wedding dress, wedding outfit dress. And a really funny thing, I was out with my sister-in-law the other night for some food, we were all out, and she showed me, she's going to a wedding as well, and she showed me a dress, and it was actually the same one, and I couldn't believe it, so she's actually wearing the same dress a few days before I wear it, so we're going to have the same outfit, but I just thought the colour when I'm all tanned, and I'm actually getting my hair done out there, so I thought if I get a nice, you know, maybe like a curl or something, I'm gonna get a nice fascinator, which I actually haven't got yet, but I love it, and I love the colour. It's so bright, but I think it's perfect for the location, and perfect because it's not super tight. It's nice and floaty. I can still tan my back on the day and my arms, so really looking forward to wearing that. So that was a good thing to start off with. And then I got this shirt from Zara. which is actually something I seen on Mary from Love Island. She was wearing that and she had it over a bikini and it looked so nice. That was the first, one of the first shirts I bought and there's actually quite a few shirts in this haul. Um, so the next one I got was from actually from H&M and it's like a green satin shirt and I thought that would also look gorgeous over a bikini but I'm not gonna lie, I haven't actually got a green bikini. So I'm not really sure, maybe with some little white shorts for like an evening, if we're just having more of a casual night, that would look good. And then, <laughs> third shirt, new one, is actually from Pretty Little Thing. And this is like the nicest print. It reminds me of Poochie, if anyone's ever seen that designer. They do like, sort of, patterns like this which I just thought was so nice and I think that was about £25. All the shirts were pretty cheap, that green one was only 18 so I think that'll look nice and I can't remember but I did order some bikinis off Pretty Little Thing last night and I might have ordered the matching bikini for the shirt but I can't remember if I took it out the basket or not. So that's like they're going to be worn over like bikinis and like daytime, maybe the green one on a night when I'm so brown and you know feeling good with a little pair of shorts I think could be quite nice. But that's kind of the shirts, and they're all gorgeous. I'm dead excited to wear them. 
And then also from Zara, I've got this little two-piece, which if you've seen in my vlogs, I have actually worn this. Um, not worn it, I have tried it on to show everyone. And it's like a little two-piece, little cord, and it's nice and bright, holiday vibe. And it's got the trousers as well. And I was thinking this for like a daytime, like breakfast vibe, like heading a breakfast outfit. But it could be worn on a night as well with a little heel, but I just think... It's lovely for breakfast vibes. So I'll also show you that. Hopefully there's an image on screen with me wearing it. So I've got that. And then last year I actually got this dress from Zara, which I took to Santorini, but I didn't wear it. And I tried it on the other night and it looked lovely. It's still got the tag on. So I'm going to take that. So that is technically new, but it is actually last year. So you probably can't get a hold of that if you like it. Um, I've kind of gone all night. I'm going into night time here, but there's a second new piece for one of the evenings I got. And that is this gold jumpsuit. And I got this from Pretty Little Thing. Kind of don't know how to show you it. I will put it on the screen so you can see. But it's like cowl neck. It's got a little bit in the middle for your, tum like your tummy to show. And then it's nice and long. My nails clicking. That's really annoying. But yeah, that'll look lovely. I have actually tried that on and really like it as well. It's hard because I haven't got a lot of new outfits for the night times. But then I think the wedding's going to be one of the days. So I only need six outfits really. And I do have two new ones there. So when you think of it like that, I can wear four things that I've already... Is that good maths? Yeah, good maths. Bloody hell. Um, so I thought that that would be a nice little... I'm saying this. I've got two outfits there and then I've actually got... Another outfit in here, kind of half of an outfit. So anyway, onto that. I've got this little white bodysuit also from Zara. And I'm gonna wear that with some pink high-waisted trousers. Maybe for like one of the first nights when I'm not like as brown as I can be. Um, it's like a um, one-shouldered body. That was only actually, yeah, 20, 19.99. So with some high-waisted pink trousers, I think that would look really lovely. Um, just kind of a bit more, like the trousers with it, like little heel. I think that'll look so nice. And then I also have forgot, there's one more shirt. Who wants to say I'm obsessed with shirts? Because I am. This is a one from Zara, which was making me... I couldn't not buy it. I love this so much. To be honest, I might end up flying in one of these shirts, one of my new ones. Maybe this, because I think with a little bodysuit underneath and some, like, with some trousers, that'll be quite a nice flying outfit. But then I do love it and probably want to wear it over a bikini. But yeah, that was from Zara. More shirts. So that's kind of that. And then I did get... A couple of new bikinis and then I've just got an order so I'll open that as well. Um, I got this bikini from Pretty Little Thing and it was a Molly, I think it's a Molly May collection. I say I think it is the Molly May collection. Um, if I'm completely honest, I don't love the fit of this. The, the bottoms are quite skimpy slash quite tight and I don't love it. But that is the print. I won't be trying that on so see it here. Um, but yeah, I do like it. I don't know whether I love it. So that potentially could go back depending on how these other bikinis turn out to be. And then also again, if you've seen my vlog, if you watch my vlogs, you'll have seen I bought some little swimsuits from Primark. So that is an orange one, which I think will look gorgeous with a tan. And then I also got a chocolate coloured one, which I really liked. And I have tried these on and they look so nice. Again, I probably am going to take these. I'm not mad on wearing a swimsuit on holiday unless I'm going to like a beach club or something. Just because I feel like it's more, you can't really tan in them. But I just wanted the option so I feel really comfortable and I've got that option just in case I want to wear some swimsuits. And then if you know me, you'll know that I love some new knickers to take on holiday. So I got loads the other week from Calvin Klein, like a big bunch of six. So I got loads of new ones. Again, if you've seen my vlog, you will have seen my little knicker haul. And then I also did get some little sets from Primark, just like little bra and knick sets, so I'll be taking them as well. I do really think when you're going on holiday, you need new knickers and new underwear. It's really nice, I just think it's a nice touch. And then also from Zara, I feel like this is like, 
I got so much, but I didn't realise. Also from Zara, I picked up this like canvas tote bag and you can like obviously you could put your, your initials on it was only 19 99 and it's just perfect for so it's got an inside bag as well but it's just perfect for like a beach bag so I thought I can either travel with this as like my travel bag and then also use it when I'm around the pool so I can put like my lotions in my sun creams my book my phone my camera and it's nice and big, so I was really thrilled with that. I thought for $19.99, to be able to personalise it as well, I thought that was actually such a good little canvas tote. So I love that. Just haven't decided whether I'm going to travel with it or just keep it for when I'm there. I want to keep it really nice, so we'll see. And then, before the bikinis, the more of a splurge product that I did pick up, I say pick up, it was very much like, Oh, it's exciting. I actually got some new Sophia Webster trainers. And again, I'm not really a trainer person. If I have had trainers in the past, they've always had like the been a pair of these before, then some Steve Madden like full sparkle ones. I don't really wear trainers because I don't really think I suit them, but these are my kind of trainer. So they were actually in the sale. They were down from, I think it was £290 to £205. And I just, I, it, it was a splurge. It was a treat myself. But they are the nicest trainers. And I've had some of these before, like I was saying. And I got so much wear out of them. The old pair I had had wings on the back. But these have got like full embellished detail. Like, tell me they are not the nicest. I just think they're amazing. And they're so fresh and crisp i can't wait to wear them i probably will travel in these to keep them like to get them there and keep them all nice but i just thought they would be good for traveling in and i will get so much wear over them like over the summer with them like with even like with this kind of dress wow my boobs are out sorry about that um but yeah like with this kind of dress like little sort of shorts and shirts in the summer i thought i'd get loads of wear so i did pick up those and i really am obsessed with them my little Sophia Webster's and I've got loads of, not loads, I have a few pairs of this um, Sophia Webster heels and I think I'm going to take a pair of them to wear with the dress for the wedding. Um, I do also have another heel option but watch my pack with me to see those because I've had them for ages kind of thing but that'll be my pack with me. So the last but not least is this delivery I've just had. So this is a pretty little thing delivery because basically yesterday I tried on all of my bikinis that I've like got and you know you take some bikinis on every holiday because they're just staple and I have quite a few but I just didn't feel like I felt like they were quite revealing if that makes sense like Obviously, we're going away with, like, a big group because it's a wedding. But, obviously, if I was just going away with Jake, I don't really mind, like, what I kind of look like, if that makes sense. Because he loves me for who I am. And not that I should care what anyone thinks. Because I don't. But I just wanted to feel comfortable around the pool. So, I did pick up some extra bikinis last night off Pretty Little Thing. Just so that I have option. Because, like I said, I wasn't mad on this one. So, we'll see. Oh, I did get the bikini to go with that shirt. So I did. Yes, so this one here is the one to go with the shirt. So I'm actually, I can't even get over the fact my boobs are out in this video. I am so sorry. It's this dress. Oh, I feel like I'm also really hot because it's so hot today. But yes, I got the bikini to go with the shirt from Pretty Little Thing. So we'll have a look at that. And before I did order these bikinis, I did check you can actually return them to Pretty Little Thing because I was mm, conscious that um, if I bought loads, I wouldn't be able to send them back. But you can as long as this the little tag is still inside. So, this is the bottoms. It actually does look pretty big, but I did want a bigger bottom because I feel like I'll not feel as revealed and then the top oh I'm so excited now get me on that plane oh the top looks small but that is the top so it's just like your normal it looks tiny but basically this is it I probably will try that on and maybe show you so if it's in here you've seen me in it then I also got a little pink number 
again i haven't tried these on so i don't know what they're gonna look like because they're brand spankers i like the look of this because it has a bigger bottom again so pink it's kind of what's that material it was called um crinkle so a pink crinkle bikini with this is kind of more like a bra top style don't know how this will look but i thought that was actually quite nice so that's the pink crinkle and then i was aware that i haven't got a black bikini so i thought i need a black bikini so i picked up just a black one off plt and it's just like quite basic with a like a black with a little ruffle on the bottom of the top and then the i would say the trousers the pants are like this crinkled also oh i think that'll be lovely actually ruffle i just want to add this in while i'm trying on the bikinis i'm not going to put my body in but this is the black bikini and honestly it is so nice and it fits perfect i got a 12 in the top and in the bottoms and it fits so nice and it's crazy how this is the first thing I've actually tried on, obviously, because I wasn't going to put them in the video. But it's crazy how when they're, it's the right size and it fits better, you just feel so much more confident. Yesterday, I was trying bikinis on and felt so sad because they just didn't fit and they were really skimpy. Um, where this fits so nice. And I think black is just classy, isn't it? Classy or classic. I don't know which one. So I'm thrilled with that. I'm going to try the rest of the bikinis on and I'm going to carry on putting all the clips in so you can see every other thing. But I just wanted to add that in because I feel good ruffled so i feel like that will be a good selection there of bikinis um so yeah that is my huge holiday haul now i've looked at everything again even though i was aware of this at the start of the video i actually do have quite a lot of new things and it's because i've bought things over like the last few months just if i've seen them pick them up and actually do have quite a lot so i'm quite happy that i didn't go to the metro and panic buy the metro by the way if you don't know as a shopping center um but yeah, I'm glad I didn't because I feel like that actually would have just been a waste of money completely. But yeah, I'm excited about all my new holiday bits. And like I say, I am going to do a pack with me and like holiday vlogs. So don't forget to check those out. They will all be up after this video. So keep an eye out for those. But yeah, that's my huge holiday haul. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to the channel. And of course, I will see you in my next video.